Hey Rack and Beer viewers. I know I don't do uh, very many beer reviews, commercial beer reviews anymore on this channel, but uh, every year uh, Ama Boikus uh, here in Denmark release these collaboration beers, a set of collaboration beers with different, usually American uh, breweries, and traditionally I've always reviewed them all the way, going all the way back to when I was doing beer reviews on my blog. So I'm gonna make an exception. I think I'm gonna, I wanna, I wanna do a review of these. I think some of them are pretty, uh, some of them are pretty conceptually, they sound really cool. So maybe you'll like to hear about them. Anyway, let's, let's just get started with it. Uh, as is tradition. I'm gonna start with uh, this one. It is All Shook Up. A double dry hopped vanilla milkshake IPA. And this is a collaboration with Elk. No. Uh, Mike. Micer. Microphone? Microphone. M I K E R. Not microphone, but microphone. My. I, okay. Sometimes I've never heard of the breweries. There's so many breweries in the U.S. now, I have completely lost track. I don't know if, if you know them. They're from Illinois, so... So, double double dry hopped vanilla milkshake. Looks like it's got... Yeah, so lactose, vanilla, and then it's got Amarillo, Mosaic, and Citra, and then the yeast is London Fog. I don't even know who makes that. Uh, I've never had it before, so... Sounds cool, kind of vanilla, kind of milkshake IPAs are uh, sort of a big deal right now. Let's pour this. Wow, it is uh, pretty, uh, pretty dirty looking. <laughs> I mean, I expect most of these beers to be pretty hazy, uh, as is the style in these days. So there you go, looks pretty muddy. Very hazy, very light head. Um, yeah, it didn't pour very, uh, kind of got aggressive there on the end, but uh, yeah, it didn't, uh, don't got a lot of head. Don't got a lot of head. That's the, that's the kind of great English you can uh, expect from my reviews. So there's what it looks like. It smells happy. Uh, it's, I mean, double dry hop is gonna do that for you. Also gonna make it look like this. Oh, I do get some of the lactose, though. Yeah. It's got that kind of milky sweetness. Now, I mean, lactose is a hard, uh, hard smell to describe. It smells like lactose. Uh, maybe the, maybe the vanilla is playing in there, too. It smells like sweet, sweet hoppy. But, uh, yeah, very smoothie-like smell. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, they started putting a uh, serving temperature on here, six to 10 degrees Celsius. Ama has also gone to these uh, 33 centiliter bottles, which I am, I fully support 110,000% because, yeah, they used to have big 500 milliliter bottles and, uh, I don't know, I just love 33 centiliter bottles. It's just something about that. Also, I can drink more of them. That doesn't have anything to do with how this tastes. It tastes, well, you get a lot, I actually get a lot of vanilla. Sometimes with these vanilla smoothie things, you don't get a lot of vanilla. This one has tons of vanilla. Lots of hops. It's kind of a, I don't want to say a mixed bag of hops, but with um, Amarillo, Mosaic, and Citra, you should get some kind of pretty tropical -y. You get some tropicalness, but it kind of, kind of gets beat up by the vanilla. So the, there's just a general hoppiness, dank, danky hopness to it. And then it's just, floors you with vanilla. It's got a pretty big mouthfeel too. And um, it's really smooth. It's, yeah, the carbonation is super low. 
I, uh, I was pretty surprised by that. Yeah. It's a nice beer. Um, the vanilla is crazy on it. I don't know if that'll age out a little bit. These, this beer is, it was bottled, I mean, it was bottled this month, so it's less than, I don't know, oh, they released it like three weeks ago. So it's, yeah, it's three weeks old, and it is, it's very fresh. It's a nice beer. These kind of vanilla milkshake IPAs have never been my favorite, because I think the vanilla really just goes to war with the hops, and kind of one or the other is going to win out. And in this one, it's definitely the vanilla. So, yeah, it's a it's a nice it's a nice beer. It's a, I don't think they've ever made one before, so it's cool to have their interpretation of it. So yeah, all shook up. If you can find it, and you like vanilla, and you like a lot of vanilla, then uh, yeah, give it a try. And uh, yeah, there's um, oh, there's a lot more of them. So uh, stay tuned for, uh, I think there's six in all, six or seven, holy crap. Uh, I have four of them right now, so stay tuned for, for a few more anyway. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Cheers, guys.